we have this um, Fender Squire 2003 guitar body. It's a, a Fender Squire SE. Not in great condition. Lots of dings. Not sure if you can see all this from the video, but there's lot, lot, lots of um, lots of dings and marks in the body. So needs needs some attention. So I'm gonna sand, sand this down. Basically, um, get it down, smooth finish, primer, and then repaint it in the same colour. That's the plan. So let's get started. Just starting off with some uh, some P120 uh, grit sandpaper. You've probably seen see now where all the uh, things are, the shiny areas on the body. Gone over most of it now with the uh, 120 grit sandpaper. But what I want to do now is uh, get some some body filler on these on all these things, and then continue sanding down. Probably uh, carry on with the 120 initially. And then just work down a little bit to uh, to a, a different uh, finer grade and see how it goes from there. And then just go ahead now and fill some of these smaller holes. But what I think I'll do first is I'll just I'll just gouge them out a little bit just to just to key them up a little bit so that the body filler will stick should have done this first before I mixed up but that's where the where the dings are the, the um, because it's lower than the surface the paint is still gloss in those areas so if I just take a little bit of that gloss off, this should help the filler to stick a little bit better. Right, I'm going to have a cup of tea and then I'll come back and um, sand that down again with the 120 grit possibly then put some more body filler on and then sand again Thank <laughs> you. 
Well, here we are, this is just about ready now for a uh, primer coat. I've been over it a couple of times with uh, body filler and, uh, and then sanded. First of all with some um, uh, some 120 and then a quick rub over with some 400. Nice and smooth now, maybe the worst thing is nice and smooth ready to paint. Mask up the neck pocket. It's important to do this if you've got a tight fitting uh, neck um, obviously the more paint that goes on there if it's not masked up it's going to uh, build up and build up and um, you'll have problems getting the neck back in there later on so if the neck's quite loose you probably maybe get away without so much masking uh, tape on or no masking tape but just be careful it doesn't build up too much that the uh, the neck won't sit back in nicely. That's I think that's about it. I'm going to give this a bit of a clean off the paint preparation wipe just before I um, just before I go ahead and paint. These are just um, what I picked up uh, from from Halfords. Quite cheap, ten pound. They're about for, for ten, ten sheets, and they uh, they are useful just before you paint, just to take any uh, anything off the uh, any dust and uh, grease and what have you just off the uh, off the surface before the uh, before the primer goes on. There we go, so while well, that's, well, that's drying, I'm going to go and uh, set the camera up um, and then we'll uh, get some primer on this and see what she looks like. 